two straight ahead. Oh, what a way to end the round. Saved by the belt. He got stunned by a huge shot right before the horn. And now, a little bit gingerly, he makes his way back to the stool. And he's only got 60 seconds to recover here. So we'll see if his corner, physically, mentally, can keep this fighter in the fight. And here's another devastating shot to the head that really does damage. And here's another shot to the head that really stuns. Several near fight ending moments in that. All right, round two. That last round was an all out draw. If they continue like that in this round, Someone's getting knocked out. Robbie Lawler is one of the Oh, man. He's back to his feet, but he's hurt. Nice jab. Oh! That one hurt. Really missed with that right hand. Well, that one should leave a mark. Outstanding leg kick employed there by Robbie Lawler. Another brutal leg kick by Lawler. No doubt about it, Joe. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not... Oh! He's got to be careful here. Big body shot, shot to the body. for the knockout victory. Oh, that was a no-doubter, Joe. That might even impress the likes of Edson Barboza. A tremendous kick to spell the end of the night for his opponent tonight. He couldn't have caught him much more flush than that, Joe. Full force beautifully extends the leg right to the target, and that is the end of the fight. You gotta think his paycheck could be $50,000 richer after that highlight turned in here tonight. And there he is, our UFC middleweight champion of the world. What an outstanding knockout here to finish the job tonight. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop in this contest at 1 minute 49 seconds of round number two. Declare the winner by knockout and still. the king of the 185 pounders there he is the undisputed ufc middleweight champion after the knockout tonight in